between Justin the Diamond Poirier and Max Holloway. So two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight they get someone that allows them to fight in their comfort zone. They don't have to worry about the take takedowns. All they have to worry about is who can rely on their knowledge in the striking to carry them to victory. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being. Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Rock him, suck him out of the suit here. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big call to the punch man. Now he gets back to range. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Nice job by Wow! Oh. He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. So one minute into this fight, as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy. Back and forth. This is a full on. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt away. Back. Changes levels now, DC. Oh, man, he was in a single, got to a high guard. Oh, takes oh, him oh, right, slams him on his back. What a takedown. How's that feel to be on the wrong it end of that? Not, I mean, I'm sad. <laughs> I knew that was I'm coming. <laughs> well, any time you are in a ground-fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fight. Oh, useful strike on the ground, that was. Just over three minutes to go. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. All right, he's got side control here, DC. You know, he's got a lot of different submissions in his arsenal once this fight gets to the ground. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Holloway's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a control posture on the bottom, and if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture. Down, big strike. Well, he has done some serious damage with these elbows, DC, and if you're on the other side, you gotta figure out a way to stop this from happening. You gotta get those hands up. You gotta block whenever you're in tight. Make sure you're not taking all these nasty elbows. A lot of top pressure being applied here. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Continuing to work out of the half guard. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Well, this is a tough fighter to buck off. Very good pressure and work here by Poirier. Ground and pound strike is true. He's putting him in exactly the positions he needs to be in right now. He's able to relax here. And he understands, being a veteran of so many fights, that as long as he's on top, he's winning. He feels like he's winning here. Under a minute to go. Gets up again here, but hurting. 75 total strikes have landed for Dustin the Diamond Pool. Get into space 
opportunity and he doesn't get finished. Well, plenty of time here to go in round one. He has really gotten off to a good start tonight. He and his corner prioritized an aggressive all-offense start to this one, and that is exactly the way it's played out. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Big kick lands. He landed a good up to oh, the five minutes down. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have to All right, here we go. Round two. Dustin Ready, the fight. Diamond Pori. Ready. And Max Ready. Blessed Holloway. Big punch lands through the middle. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Holly. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Just out of range with that right hand. Big punch land. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. Oh, well-timed overhand there by Holland. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Poirier gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. Doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot oh. of first strikes. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Both guys landing at a pretty decent clip. Lower jaw, very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Big punch lands. Oh, oh, punch lands. That's as good a punch as he's thrown. The punch that lands down the middle, the one that you don't feel, is the one that lands perfect. And that one landed perfect. So the numbers thus far, 111 total strikes have landed for Dustin Poirier. And the accuracy rate about 42% now against Max Holloway. All right, so Dustin Poirier with a nice one-two there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up. He has natural power in the right, but he's developed great power in the left. He's a problem, man. He's big, he's strong, and Dustin Poirier has job of doing just that. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the victory by TKO. Huge result inside the Octagon tonight.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 47 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO, Dustin McDonald. Well, there he is, the man of the hour. And you gotta think this dude's gonna get a serious Instagram push tonight.